In a little town called North Webster, Indiana, there's one of the most state-of-the-art Mustang and F-150 facilities in the world. You wouldn't expect to find it here though. You see, Indiana is one of the Great Lakes states, and Northern Indiana is mostly gently rolling forest and prairie. But it's also the home of Brenspeed. Brenspeed's building is impressive. 20,000 square feet, complete with dyno testing and engine building facilities, in-house engineering, and of course, a large parts warehouse. But that's not the entire story. Company owner Brent White started Brenspeed in 2002 with a vision for a performance shop where mail order, engine building, and full installation service all worked hand in hand. Making that vision come to life took years of hard work, and it all started in a home garage. Hi, my name's Bucko, and today we've traveled all the way to Indiana to show you one of the most amazing Mustang facilities you're ever gonna see. And believe it or not, it all began right here in a garage behind this quaint little property situated in North Webster. Let's go and have a chat to the man who started it all. Brent White. Great to finally meet you, mate. Nice meeting you, Bucko. Thanks for having us down here at your house. No I'm, problem. Uh, I'm really curious to find out exactly where it all started. Is this the infamous I'll garage? I'll tell you what, this is it. Basically, back in the day when I had this idea, I wanted to own a Mustang company. I had a garage outside my house, and this is where I decided to start it. I had an office right here. I had a very small warehouse next door with inventory in it. I worked on cars right here. I had this idea in my head of exactly what I wanted to do. I didn't see really any other company out there doing exactly what my goal was. So I thought it would be an awesome thing to try to accomplish. And it just, everything worked out really, really good. And now, obviously, after a couple of moves, you've ended up at the facility that we're going You're to You're right. And I was able to grow everything big enough to move to a couple other places. And then we were able to build the new facility we have right now. All right, and that's what we're down here to see. So let's go over to the facility and take a look. To say that this is an amazing facility is no exaggeration. Inside this expansive building behind me, Brinspeed houses not only a full parts warehouse, but an R&D section, complete end-to-end -end dyno testing, there's an engine room and an engineering area where Brinspeed create their branded products. On top of that, there's an installation area with two lifts, which give them the capability to do full vehicle builds for their customers, an awesome showroom, and a pretty cool customer service lounge to hang out in. But on top of all of this, Brinspeed even offer a free guest house for customers that are visiting from out of town. So let's not waste any more time. Head inside and check out some of the action. We found ourselves in the installation facility. Now, Brent, this is a very, very big room. What was the idea when you developed this? Well, we had designed this entire building from the ground up specifically for our business. So when we designed this room, we wanted to have it large enough to keep the customer's cars safe inside at night. Right, well, looking around, I can see one of a particular type of car. I'm talking about a Mustang, obviously. Bit of a specialty here. Yeah, when you come and take a tour through our facility, you're normally gonna see Mustangs and F-150s, that is our specialty. Just about anything you can think of that's gonna make your car go faster, we do that in here every single day. And from a customer point of view, that's gotta be a big advantage because you're not practicing on their cars, are you? We always own three or four Mustangs. We call them our engineering cars that we use to develop the packages that we mail order and test out all the products that we sell. It makes the installation time go pretty quick and it makes you allowed to come in here, get your installation performed and leave a heavy customer. And you've got the warehouse right here as well, which has got to come in handy when you're looking for a part. It's pretty much start to finish. Everything's here in stock. We control the inventory so we can perform the entire installation with products we have over in our warehouse, all the way to the end when it goes on the dyno for the dyno tin. So pretty much full service here. Absolutely, yeah. from start to finish. Well, Brent, everybody knows what a dyno does, but what does Brinspeed use it for? Our dyno cells use probably 90% for our own in-house mail order package development, for calibrating customers' cars or for receiving installations, and also for various calibration work for aftermarket performance parts manufacturers. Now, obviously, at some point when people have been working on their stock engines for a while and they've been pushing the envelope of horsepower, they're gonna want a little bit more. They really wanna go to the extreme level, and that's something that you guys can do here with your engine building room, right? Yeah. Can we go and take a look? Let's go look. 
So here we are in the clean room, and this is where all the magic happens. As you can see behind me, we've got Ken to here wrenching on the engine. Brent, I find it fantastic that you actually build your own engines in-house. Yeah, that was one of the decisions we made on designing this new facility was we wanted to have an engine clean room. Over the years, we faced a really big problem with sourcing engines out from other companies. So when we build them here ourselves, I can control the quality, but at the same time, I can make sure these engines are in stock, ready for installation, or ready to mail order out to other countries. Excellent. And what are the kind of customers that you get, you're sort of getting in the market for these types of engines? Although we have a lot of customers that are adding a supercharger package to their car, Basically, after a while, they start getting an itch for more power. So once we've exceeded the limit of that factory engine, that's when someone will start looking at one of our custom engines. Excellent. Well, I guess it's time to go and test it myself. Brent White's dream has turned into an amazing facility and company. Do yourself a favor and head to North Webster in Indiana, because Brent's speed is more than worth it.